All right, back at it, heat big garage. We're in a bit of a predicament. As you can see, Joe is all the way down there. And he's looking for something. So basically, we went to get a little more in the Ford Ranger and the serpentine belt popped on us, which has happened multiple times already. I probably should have had an extra, but I didn't. That's good. So we're pulled over here in the Ranger. Where's the old serpentine belt at? There's the belt. Right here. We could try to run it, but no, absolutely not. One rib on there, if you don't see that. Been running it with four ribs, but yeah, this ain't gonna work out. So we're gonna try, that was the old one. That's the old serpentine belt right there that uh, was originally on the Ranger. I had another one on there that it tore through because most likely, I mean, y'all see these pulleys, we kind of rig some shit up. I mean, there ain't supposed to be just two bolts in there. It's a little wonky. Wasn't planning on driving this Ranger this much. Tensioner is not the original tensioner. It's actually supposed to be on like a 4.0. The harmonic balancer, you see those fucking washers in there. This pulley right here is squeaking like a son of a bitch. One of those factors in there is causing the serpentine belts to flop. Um, now we're stuck. And I'm hoping he finds that belt walking down there. And if he don't, we're gonna have to call somebody to come bring us a belt. It appears that Joe did not find the belt. And he's probably calling his wife to bring us a serpentine belt. If I had to guess, that's probably what's happened. This is third time that it's blew a serpentine belt on this Ranger. But it'll go like a couple of weeks without doing it. And then sometimes, like literally just now, we got this lawnmower right here. Like we got the lawnmower, left, went like a mile down the road. Popped the serpentine belt. It's like, well, f put it back on. Kept driving, literally like two minutes later, popped off, gone. <sighs> It's a little frustrating. If you ain't driving a Ranger that pops a serpentine belt every fucking two minutes, then what are you doing? Are you a mechanic? Because I ain't, but I'm driving it. So we're going to try to figure this out. We can make a serpentine belt out of zip ties. Find anything, Joe? Yeah. Found it? Yeah, it's broke. It's broke. Way down there. Well, that's good. I'm really out of shape. Yeah. Um, See how close our story is. 11 miles, 10 miles, 11 miles, 10 miles, 10 miles, 10 miles. Oh. Um, how much gas? Yeah. You think you're gonna take the fucking lawnmower? Ain't no fucking way. We ain't got shit for gas. You're gonna have to go into the heart of the city in there. Cause they're. Yeah, in a lawnmower. There's no, yeah. there's no <laughs> auto parts store around here. I promise you. Yeah, it's, it's all like in the city, miles. and that thing ain't making it ten miles then back. That might. Without getting a ticket. Gas. No. Oh, well. We can make it with gas. There's a gas station right there. The right. Other option. One rib. Or we run one rib, which will not Zero work. Ribs. Zero ribs. Or we take some damn wiring right here. So just and the RCA cables can make one out of this. It's actually not a terrible idea. I was hoping for some rope. Dude, check it out, though. It's got the rib in it. Yeah. It's hoping, not. It's I was not. hoping for some rope. I ain't gonna lie. It ain't terrible, How though. How many zip ties does it take? I know. I said that, too. I was though. like, yeah, we should do it out They're of They're extra time. long. It ain't it's gonna work. Works. It We'd have to put two of them, like, like thicker. But not just one thick, like two or three thick. The crazy thing is... We don't need to run that much. We don't need power steering. We need 10 miles. We don't need power steering. Okay. So It'd be nice. If but... we literally ran the water pump and the alternator, that's a smaller belt. We ain't got a socket set, do we? Yes. We have a socket yes. set? Okay, so what well, if we remove the tensioner pulley? We'd have to remove the tensioner pulley, yes. Okay. And then. <laughs> Zip ties. <laughs> Oh, God. I'm the dove right on in. Hold, 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 hold the camera, hold the camera. We have done yeah. dove right on in. Socket set. Probably missing a 10. This is turning into an interesting video. <laughs> I, I was not, I was, I said it, I think you'll catch it earlier in the video. I said it as a joke. I was like, well, maybe we can do it out of zip time. So the plan is to remove the tensioner because we only need a water pump 
and an alternator, and we could drive. Yeah. What's the title of this video going to be? Uh, is it zip ties? Will it serpentine belt? <laughs> the crazy thing is we have an infinite number of zip ties. So <laughs> it only has to make it like 10 miles. No, it only needs to go like half a mile over. Oh, I mean, this whole bag just has to last us 10 miles. See, knowing our luck, somebody's going to pull in, try to pull into here. Of course. While we're doing this, we're going to be like, look, I'm sorry, we're not trying to steal your so we don't know whose driveway this is. We gotta be careful in this ranger because it's not technically road ready. We'll just put it like that. According to the it's law. It's not road road legal. According to the law, yes. Technically. So I mean, but we're in Mexico. Right. I was speaking to some people. I think we need to pull in here. Are you serious? No. We're good. Shoot. Alright, they're calling the cops. Alright, I can't get in my driveway. Got two idiots in here working on a Ford Ranger with a racing mower on the back. <laughs> Sorry about the wind noise, guys. This was uh, definitely an impromptu, not expected video. How long is this Oh! <laughs> I'm yelling, don't to call the cops. I don't think anybody's home. Joe, go knock on the door and see if someone's home. No, thank you. Answer, delete. So now, Direct the plan day. is to literally Zip tie everything to everything here. We're gonna use the longest zip ties first. So that means they break. Make sure you speak loud so they can hear you too. Yeah, they're gonna use. We're gonna you use the longest zip loud. ties that we have, so that when they break, we'll only be forced to use the small ones. Yeah. Looks like it's gonna take four to five yeah. zip ties. Okay, looks like it's gonna take six. Six zip ties. No way this works. If I start this thing up and that water pump starts turning, I'm gonna be very surprised. The only thing we really gotta worry about is RPM. You think we should throw like a second one on there no, for I'm good measure? I'm gonna throw like three. Okay, good. <laughs> All right, that's two. Looking good. Not a lot of tension on it, but is it spinning? Yes. No. It's halfway working. Okay, this side. All right, let's try that. All right. All right, here we go. Dude. <laughs> the zip ties are there working. There ain't bro. no way, bro. The f***ing zip ties are working. Well, I'm, I might just drive it like that. It's been eating through so many serpentine belts to drive it with zip ties. Holy All right, right. 10 miles to the park store. <laughs> All right. Challenge accepted. All right, guys. Let's see uh, if this thing's gonna make it. Okay, auto zone 10 miles. It's now. Nice. So I gotta remember, I got a lawnmower with just one ratchet strap back here. No tailgate. Are we charging? Barely. No. Well, we don't need a charging system. Man, wants to get on the highway. Really? I think so. That's still about 12 miles. What'd you say? Two miles. No, we've 
9.7 miles. 9.3 miles to go. Is this the closest one? Yeah. We might have to hit the power. I'm telling you, we can go in town. Go in town then. Right. It's still cold. Like, it's still it's normal like, for right. this Ranger. See, there's nothing that zip ties can't fix. We had duct tape. If we had fucking duct tape, we'd go to fucking Africa in this thing. In fact, I mean, it's a when you have a Ford fucking Ranger, zip ties, duct tape, and a little duct tape, maybe a vice grip every once in a while. I mean, that's all you need. Cheap Chinese tool set. Cheap Chinese tool set. But really, like zip ties, Ford Ranger. You're a mechanic. Yep. You don't even have to learn. Yeah. You don't have to learn. Just improvise. That's all you got to do. You take it to your mechanic, they're like, well, we'll have to tow it. You know what we say? Put some f***ing zip ties on that thing, man. All right, now we're starting to do free work. Free work. Oh, the tip tip? Yeah. That's good. Show them where it's at. Because this is what uh, we're talking on. about. Like, this is, hold this on, is where, that's where she normally stays. And that's where she's at right now. Like, so when we tell you it's creeping, like, it's almost normal. Yeah, <laughs> she's coming up. Yeah, she's, she's coming up. Coming up. So I might need to start look, looking for somewhere to pull over. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna need somewhere to pull over. I think there's a store up here. No, it's going back down. No way, bro. Yeah, it's going back down. No, it's going up. All right. She's getting a little frisky. Okay, she's going up. Oh, oh I hit it too. Oh, Jesus. I'll try. All right, cut this mother. Yeah. Cut it off. Okay. All right. Dude, we went four, five miles. All right, let's see how they're doing. All right, we're down to one zip tie. Down to one zip tie? One zip tie. So literally, what, how many miles we get out of that thing? Five. We got five miles, guys, out of this zip tie right here the before cheap, it broke. The cheap zip ties, too. Now, and we still got one left. All right, so we're gonna put another set of zip ties on it, or one extra. Replace the one that went missing, and we're gonna run it again. <laughs> we're gonna get to the auto parts store and get us a serpentine belt. <laughs> that is wild. Yeah, we're fucking geniuses. Genius. I mean, 2.3 liter Ford Ranger. Get. I mean, she's living life on the edge now, baby. I might take it up to 6,000 RPMs when we get back on the road. Even think huh? <laughs> All right. Three sets, so equal to three ribs. Yes. Make sure you trim your zip ties, guys, at a 45 degree angle. All right. I declare ye roadworthy once again. Probably should have checked the strap for the lawnmower before. No, we're good. Off. We're good. good. Yeah, it's good. All right. Back on the road. On the road again. Indiana land. All right. How Three ribs. Three ribs. Yeah. Three ribs. All right. So we added two to the mix. We really didn't even test run it. We didn't even check it this time, but... No, we're, just, we're confident. confident. Yeah. Confident in our repair. Everybody, you know, you got to be confident in everything. Especially your parts. Like, Ten minutes away from the parts. Dude, this thing works long. Yeah, I think I'm still running. Hey, let's just go to the beach, man. Yeah. yeah. Hey, Trying to drive to California real quick? Yeah, I got a Ford Ranger and some zip ties, baby. I'm ready to go. Don't even need no gas, baby. Everybody looking at us. You know it's some bad motherfuckers when you're driving a Ford Ranger. You see somebody with a Ford Ranger with a tractor flap and a fucking racing lawnmower on the back? You don't fuck with them. <laughs> they might use zip ties for anything. Not even, neither me or Joe are Ford guys. Definitely not. Not a chance. Like, there's not a chance I'm going to the dealership right now like, I want a Ford. You know what I'm saying? But I am very impressed. By the old Fords, yes. I am very impressed by this 94 Ford Ranger. Yes. This 500 bucks. 500 dollars. Manual. Two wheel drive. Paul, 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 Paul truck. Beat on it daily. Beat it. Like, literally, I'm not kidding. Like, he beats on this. <laughs> yeah, I got owes him money. Put a clutch in it. And it was good. 
2.2 miles left. 2.2. We've only had to change the zip ties once. One, one time. Yeah, one time. And it was five and a half miles in. Yeah. And keep in mind, guys, that was two ribs, technically. Two ribs of zip ties. One of them's still on there, and we added two more to make three. I can't believe it worked. I said it as a joke. And then you come up serious about it, and it's like, okay, well, we both said it. Let's go. <laughs> I said that shit as a joke. I looked at him, I was like, yeah, guys, maybe we'll put some zip ties on there. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> well. We did it. Now. It's working. It's one mile left. Man, I'm about to start fucking doing Uber in this thing. Pop a serpentine belt. All right, let's put some zip ties on it. Where you got to go, buddy? When I was a kid, it was always up there. <laughs> yeah. I was like, no power steering treat yet. Yeah. So we're 0.7 miles away, riding downtown, cruising. Zip ties. Serpentine belt. Delete with zip ties. Cruising. What is that, a Mustang over there? You ain't got shit on this Ford Ranger. Well, you got a serpentine belt? I am. Well, you got a serpentine belt? Huh. I got zip ties, son. Zip. Toss! For the win. Come on. We're we almost it. there. I can see it. Yeah, we're good. I ain't even worried. What are you worried about? Huh? What are you worried about? I'm worried about us hitting every stoplight between here and there and overheating. <laughs> yeah, we're hitting this one right here. We'll be all right. She ain't even got to operate temperature. What are you talking about? Yeah, but once it starts... It's over. Yeah. Come on, baby. There we go. That is crazy. And this video is, this, at least this part, is completely off the cuff. Like, this was not expected. Definitely at all. not. We did not expect to lose a serpentine belt and then pull the one that was already shredded out the back and then literally split it in half to where it's no longer a circle anymore. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, this right here is crazy. Literally, guys, I, uh, 15, a total of 15 zip ties. That's our serpentine belt right now. 15. And AutoZone is right here. There's a van, so I'm going to go to AutoZone just because I'm bougie. And my Ranger can make it. I could stop at the park store right here, but guess what? I'm cocky with this money. I'm going to the AutoZone about 100 feet up the road. 100 feet further. Uh, yeah. yeah. No power steering. Let's pull right over here on this. Uh, yeah. I know how to park in a parking lot, so I ain't yeah, uh, go ahead and park between the white lines. <laughs> I know. All right, guys. We have successfully made it to AutoZone. We made it. 15 zip ties. Yeah. Let's check on it. Let's see how she's doing in there. Two of them still left. We still got two left. Y'all can't say shit about this Ford Ranger anymore. <laughs> oh, yeah, bro. 